Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to our channel. Aspen's enjoying a little bit of TV and watching a little bit of learning stuff right this minute because I'm getting ready to edit the vlog. Riley's on the way downstairs. She just finished getting dressed. And um, let me tell you what's going on today. And like, I want to say I'm stressed out. I am stressed out a little bit, okay? It's nothing majorly to be stressed out about. But it's like, you know how when you want something, you wanna get your hands on it? And I feel like I can't get my hands on it and it's like driving me crazy. All right, so there is a viral Christmas tree that's been going around like TikTok. It went around last year, so definitely couldn't get my hands on it last year. <clears throat> Honestly, forgot about it for this year and it pops back up on my page. I was like, oh my gosh, yes, I was gonna order that tree. After Christmas last year, if they got any in or had any come back in the store, I was gonna try to snag one. Hey, baby, what are you doing? You watching TV? Huh? So, anyway, I was like, you know, I'll snag the tree later. Not a big deal. Well, then I'm like, okay, let's go on there, let's order it. I went on there yesterday. Every store was pretty stocked. I mean, every store that I looked at. I want to say like one location had 10, another had six or seven. The average was like at least two. Maybe a couple stores had one, but most of them had at least two to three. That was kind of the average. But six was a good number I kept seeing, but 10 was insane. I know one store had 10. I was like, oh yeah, I ordered it, no big deal. Like I wasn't sweating it too bad. Well, I forgot yesterday. We got busy, life happened, and I forgot. Well, this morning I wake up, first thing this morning with it on my mind, like 7.30. I'm like, okay, hold on. I need to go order that tree. Well, then I went on TikTok just to look at it, to double check that is the one I want, yada, yada, yada. And I'm like, yep, I'm gonna do it. So I go on there to buy it. Has sold out, literally overnight. What? And I'm thinking, how did that even happen, right? Three stores had them. The one store that had 10, none. But I went on there this morning, three stores had it. So I was like, okay, good, I'll at least get one. So I placed the order. So excited, I'm gonna go pick up my tree later. And I get a text message saying, sorry, we've canceled your order. Your card will be refunded this amount of money because we are out of stock of the item. They had six. So obviously, I don't know what happened. Maybe the numbers were wrong, and then when they went to go finally pull it, they're like, oh my gosh, we have none. So they refunded that, but it takes five days to get it refunded. So I've already spent like $400 on this tree that the money is just like not there because I've already used it. So they're gonna refund the money. Well, me, I'm like, well, I want this tree. So I go back on there. I find another store that said they had five, four or five. I bought it again. So not only have I charged my card like $800 right now, but here I have, I've bought this tree twice now. I don't understand why they don't have the option to like choose to ship it or choose a different store. Nope, they just cancel your order, refund your money. Okay, so I'm like, that's fine. So I placed the order again, second tree. I'm sitting on pins and needles right now waiting for that text to say, your order's complete, it's ready for pickup, or your order has been canceled, we don't have the item. I mean, it's going on now almost two hours. It said it takes at least two hours for them to pull it. The first store, within 30 minutes, had wrote me back or sent me a text and said, we don't have the item. So I was like, okay, this one won't take as long. Well, we're sitting now in like literally four minutes or so. It's gonna have been two hours since I placed that order. You guys, I am crossing everything I own trying to get this tree. And if they say they don't have it, you can't have it shipped. Here's the problem though. There's only three available to ship. I want this tree. We're redoing the whole living room this year. When I say redoing, the Christmas stuff. Tree's not going there this year. We got a different idea, or at least Kayla and me came up with it yesterday. Did we tell you? Yes, I think I did mention. We're gonna put the tree right, right where I'm sitting. That is what's going on right now. We are on the hunt for this viral TikTok tree. And honestly, if they cancel this order, I'm probably gonna place the order for shipping. And if they cancel that one, I might even go store to store today and just try to find it anyway. I told Riley, I said, be on standby. If I say, let's go, let's go. If they say I don't have it, I'm probably gonna place it for shipping and then I'm gonna get in the car and I'm going store to store and look for it. You guys, let's hope, hope they text me here shortly and they're like, we got your order pulled. Like, I stress over the stupidest stuff probably. That's probably something really stupid. And worst case, we have a Christmas tree this year or we could buy a different one, but this is the one I want. And the good thing about me getting it is Kayla 
wants a new Christmas tree as well. So she's like, Mom, can I just buy yours? I'm like, yeah, absolutely. I mean, I'm gonna have no need for it unless I put it in my bedroom. So that's the plan. They also have a slim version of this tree that originally I was thinking about if I kept the tree there because it's hard to put a full size tree there without walking by and popping it, you know, because it's so tight in that space. But um, the slim tree, they seem to have a little more qu quantity on. Now, is the website accurate? Probably not. I'll probably go in store and they don't have that either. But I told Kayla, I was like, worst case, if they cancel everything today after I place it 400 times, I may go in store today and if I have to get the slim one, I get the slim one for this year. And then after Christmas, if anybody brings one in the store or as soon as they list them on their website, like next year, I'm gonna go ahead and buy the full size and then put the slim one upstairs in my bedroom next year. I think that's what I'm gonna do. That's how I feel like it'll go down if they don't have the tree. Now, if I go in store and they don't even have the slim one, we're back to square one, guys, or we may just have to keep the tree we had last year and do it one more year and then wait for that tree again. It's just frustrating because I was like so sure I was gonna get it yesterday. I was like, oh yeah, they got plenty of them. And I forgot, then I go in there this morning and they're like sold out everywhere. Wish me luck. How was lunch? Is that why you're putting it in a bag? Take it with you? <laughs> no, that was her leftovers and she couldn't eat it all. So she could just put it in the bag and throw it away. Well, I'm trying to not eat it all. I am. It's okay. You're doing good. I'm proud of you. I guess. Yeah, I am proud of you. I'm trying as hard as I can. Yeah. It's hard. It is very hard. Especially when you're pregnant, like I can still eat like I know. Like I'm still starving. I'm proud of you though, because I would have probably finished it all. I'm still hungry. I know. Take you something to, do you have anything to munch on at work? No. You need to bring you like your grapes and things like that. Well, I ate grapes this morning. Yeah. Like a morning snack. Do I need a washwasher? I mean I could throw in I could throw in a dishwasher. And then I had grapes. I had a bagel this morning for breakfast. And I did look like cream cheese. <laughs> oh gosh, it's so hard. I know it is, babe. And it's just like, it's because like I want to eat. I mean, I'm pregnant. Yeah, I get it. What pregnant person doesn't want to eat? Absolutely. I mean, I didn't want to eat at the beginning when I was like sick. But now that I'm not sick, I'm just hungry. Yeah. <laughs> but. <laughs> Throwing something away. <laughs> but it's just. Oh gosh, it's so hard. It's really like <laughs> I'm like thinking about like mm, what I want for dinner already. <laughs> <laughs> you can eat. Just pick better options. That's it. I thought like that was better. Oh, yeah, yeah. Typical lunch usually is. Yes. Even if I would have ate all that, that would have been better than my typical That's lunch. That's what I'm saying. Eat but, until you're full, <clears throat> but you know, just don't eat past it and just pick better options. I'm trying. Not if good. you gotta eat seven, eight small meals a day just to keep you eating something, do it. Just choose better stuff. I mean, and I know that's hard because I'd much rather eat junk food and I had real food. Yeah. That's I'm just a snacker. Me too. I want to snack on like I'd rather have tortilla chips, chips than eating a salad. Do you know what I mean? I got you. Chips, cookies. Mm-hmm. Something easy just to grab and go. Yep. 100%. But, I don't know, like I feel like my lunch break today was spent cooking. It was. That was the only bad thing. Yeah, she's got to leave here in just a minute, but at least she ate. Yeah, but I was going to make a sandwich today, but I just didn't have time to make breakfast, get Aspen ready, get myself ready, take Charlie out, feed Charlie, get out the house and here and make lunch all before. So I just grabbed that. I was like, whatever. I know. But... It is what it is, and the weekend, of course, is this week, or now, mm -hmm. and that's always the hardest. Absolutely. Everyone always falls on the diet on the weekend. Yep, they sure do. And here I am starting it. <laughs> not a diet, I guess. It's yeah. It's really a diet. you just it's watching just like, what you eat. try not to gain a lot more weight. Yeah. Like, if I gain a little bit, I'm going to gain weight. Obviously, mm -hmm. I'm carrying babies. They're gaining. Mm -hmm. So, it's going to make me heavier. Yeah. But... I'm trying not to gain an excessive amount of weight. Yeah. And it's hard. It's hard. I know it is. <laughs> and it's hard not pregnant. Absolutely. And then on top, tacking on like just cravings mm -hmm. and like things you want. Yep. 
Like, I would kill for some cold stall right now. I'm still thinking about it. That doesn't mean you can't ever have it either. You know that, I know, right? I'm like, I told Kay, hey, I'm like, just don't do it every get day. Like a little bit. Like, don't get a full size. Actually, if you want a full size, do it. He was like, it's only okay. you can have it. I was like, yeah, but I feel bad starting a healthier lifestyle. <laughs> Like, first first week, go get cold stone. <laughs> first few days, I'm like, we're gonna get cold stone. <laughs> I know the weekends when I used to always do my cheating, for sure. Yeah, so it is what it is. But I've been taking my baby aspirin. I took it today. Proud of I've you. Been taking my multivitamin. I took that today. Okay. I got to take my folic acid here because no. I no, don't that. didn't take it this morning. Cause don't I don't want to take all of that together don't at the same time. Mm -hmm. So do my multivitamin first thing in the morning. Did my baby aspirin when I got to work with breakfast. Because they said eat it, I'll take it with food. And then I'm going to take my folic acid before I go back to work. Okay. But I'm so out of breath. You're pregnant? I know. Jesus, talking's like running. Did it die? No, it keeps turning on and off. It needs a battery. I mean, he's charging. <laughs> Whoa, now. You don't know the words? You do not know the words? I, I don't know half of the Yes, you do. No, we we I sing this the all the time. No, I know the beginning and the end. There's just some parts I don't know. Oh, wow. Well, I know what we're going to study tomorrow. I mean, Monday in school. For sure. Gross. I know, right? It ain't Saturday. Tomorrow? Tomorrow, yes. Okay. What are you trying to do? A what? Around the world. Around the world. Tell me what it is. It just charges with a you USB. You pretty much like juggle it and then like, I'm about to charge it. You pretty much juggle it, then you like lift it in the air, put your whole foot around it and then catch it and keep doing it. I'm just trying to juggle it once, put my, hand, put my foot around it and hit it again. That's what I'm trying to do right now and then I'll have to juggle it into it, but I can't even get the freaking foot around it. Show me. Go up really hi higher with it so you got time to go around it. There's probably a video that'll help you learn it easier. Hey, instead of practicing that, just practice bouncing it on the floor and putting your foot around catching it. Just bounce it. Don't worry about the juggling part. See? Just get that first. Yeah. So, update on the Christmas tree is... There's no update. Let me explain what I mean by that. Okay, so place the order. Supposed to her back in like two hours. Didn't hear anything. They were supposed to either email or text or both. Um, I called the store and through the automated thing, gave them my information and they said my order was ready for pickup. So I'm like, yes, did I get it? But I'm gonna be honest with you, until it's sitting in my possession, I actually have it in the vehicle that we're driving. <laughs> I don't trust it. Um, so, Dad's on the way home. He should be here shortly. We're going to leave here and go straight there and see if we can pick it up. Still to this point right now, it's almost 3 o'clock. Never got an email, never got a text saying the order was ready. But when I call the store, it says my order's ready for pickup. All right, so change of plans. We are not going to get the tree first because traffic has been crazy. There's been some wrecks out on the main roads. We've had to take some back roads to kind of get here. And um, we're trying to get here so we can actually eat. And then um, Briley's leaving with her friend to go off and they're going like costume shopping or something for Halloween. And we're gonna leave at that point, go grab the tree if they have it. Then we're gonna come back to the rink. Aiden has practice, but also the state games tonight. It was between the state game tonight or go on a haunted hayride, and the vote was, let's just do the state game. I don't care. So, state is versing Carolina tonight. Um, should be a really good game. They're talking about it's probably going to be sold out. So, I just bought our tickets, but I told Brian, I was like, you guys need to come back. Not too late, just so you can make sure you get a seat and there's room. Because... I'm not gonna be able to get up and go to Aiden's practice, and probably neither is Barry because we'll be on one rink, he'll be on the other. Anyway, yeah, so that's the plan. We're about to go there, gonna eat, I'm hungry, and then um, we're gonna go get that tree soon, so stick around. Hope they have it. We've left the rink, I didn't vlog anything there. Um, Briley is there, we just have Aiden. 
Yep. Just one kid with us. Riley's hanging back because they're getting ready to leave to go look at Halloween stuff. And Riley goes, you're leaving me right now? You're leaving me right now? I'm like, yes, we're leaving you right now. I said, because if we don't go right now, we're not going to be back in time. All right, here we go. Let's see, moment of truth. Moment of truth, guys. Oh, that's a big Santa. Look at the Santa. That's cool. I see him. I see him. Okay, let's see if we can spot the tree. How much is it? What's he made of? Oh, it's plastic, okay. All right, let's see if we can, is it this one right here? I'm not sure which one it is. Yeah, this is it. That's it right there. This is the tree. See, it changes colors. It does all kinds of things. Is this the I don't know. No, I think this is the, the size. Yeah, 25. Yep. Do y'all like it? Yeah. Awesome. He said I'm going to the back to get it, so we should have it, guys. Oh, my gosh. That's cool. Wow. Animated. What does he do? Does he do something? Looks like a Halloween decoration, don't it? <laughs> Not so much a Christmas one. Oh, look at the Grinch. He's animated too, eh? Yeah, the flock ones are beautiful, but they are so messy. You remember that time we got flock trees and Aiden could not? Like, yeah. he got a headache and he's itching. It was horrible. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Turn him around so I can see him. That's actually kind of cute. Put him on the fireplace. Aspen would love it. Can I get it? Oh my gosh, how much is he? Uh, 24. I think he's 24. Oh, he's yeah. so cute. Is he? Well, oh, yeah, he's, he's moving. Look, Aiden. Oh, yeah. Look, What's the is. toy soldier do? Hit it again? I don't know. He's not working. Hey, I think they do. Look, his mask moves. The ornaments light up. Those would be pretty. Wow. I have a ton of different trees to choose from. My goodness. Do you remember these? It's Charlie. My mom used to have these. Look, it's Charlie. Is that what they're called? I don't know what they're called, but yeah, see, they light up now, which ours plugged in. You remember, they weren't LED. They were just like old. Yeah. You take those, you look at the trees, remember? Yeah. We got the viral tree. I'm so excited. It happens if it don't fit in your truck. I let the car go rolling. I'm so excited to put this up for you guys. Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. Oh, I cannot believe we got one. Woohoo! gonna be in practice for like the first hour of the game. The they game's an hour long. No, the game's longer than an hour, but I'm saying you're gonna be in practice the first hour of them playing. Oh. The game starts at eight, your practice will be starting at 745. Are you upset? You good about it? Okay, good. I wanna practice. Yeah, I know you they do. They don't have the hallway blocked off. Then come through the hallway. Oh, when daddy sees you can come grab you. Yeah. Okay? All right, do good in your practice, and I hate I can't oh, film man, it. Oh man, wait. What? What? Oh. I was gonna say. Oh no, they shouldn't, cause they don't. They don't have a rope over there. I might send Dad over before your practice is completely. Like at at eight o'clock, I say you wait right there in that tunnel, and I'll let Dad go over there and get you. Eight o'clock. At eight o'clock. I mean, I mean. At, my practice. At is... nine, when you're out of the locker room, I'm probably gonna have Dad go over there in the tunnel and wait for you. Is that oh, fun? It's gonna take me like until ten to get out of the locker. Room. Okay. So. Okay. Okay. Well, just meet your dad. Oh, well. In the tunnel.
lighting is gonna be crazy, but we're on the road, we're heading home. It is after, oh, that's so bright, but it works. He turned off his phone. <laughs> it is after midnight. We're all so tired. I still have to edit the vlog for tomorrow. And we're getting up mega early in the morning to go to a pumpkin farm because we need pumpkins to carve for Halloween. So we're gonna go do like a little hay ride and everything. Should be a lot of fun. And that means we have to go to bed like as soon as we get home and get up really early in the morning. I don't know when I'm gonna edit the vlog. That's what I'm stressing about because it's already after midnight. We're just getting home and then we have to be up so early in the morning to get showers, get dressed, and leave that I'm concerned I'm not gonna have time to do it, you know? So, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might try to get up early in the morning and get it done then, because I feel like that'd be the best thing to do. But we gotta hurry and get home so I can get to bed, so I get some sleep before tomorrow. But tonight was fun. The game was really good. It was like tight scoring the entire game. One would score, the other would score. The next would score, I mean, it was just back and forth with them. And um, the final score ended up being, what was it, five, five to four? four? Yeah, and state one. In so, overtime. In overtime, it was in overtime, that's right. Aiden had a great practice. He's just really tired like the rest of us. Like, I feel like I can't hold my eyes open. I'm so sleepy right now. I know, Aiden's exhausted. He's gotta get a shower. Ugh, but it's all good. What? Got a game. Yeah, he's got a game tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Riley had fun, didn't you, Bri? Mm -hmm. No, y'all can't even see me. I get that. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end it here because I'm ready to go to bed when I get there to the house. So if you enjoyed our vlog, hit the thumbs up. Leave us a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.